on. Hopefully you can hear me all right. Um, I am working, I am on my way to my route. Gotta do some delivering. On my way out to the country and I still got a little ways to drive, so. I wanted to do a video. I'm just gonna start ranting, uh, you know, different topics on these videos, you guys. Um, yeah, I don't, not many people have been watching my recent videos, which I like to, I would hope, you know, some people would watch them at least. Um, do you go on my most popular videos? It still gets views every day. It has like um, 1,700 views all over that. But uh, I was wanting to talk about anxiety while working. As you know, anxiety is a big topic, and you guys would be surprised to how many people that's out there that has so many things in common with you. I know I would read comments of like other videos on uh, anxiety and like different symptoms that I get. There would be so many people that would describe theirs, and it's exactly the same as me. It's so crazy. That's why I do these videos try to bring people in and. Uh, see what everybody deals with and how you manage it but uh when you have to work anxiety is very bad especially if you don't exactly like what you do um like i would rather work from home like i do have some things i like to do goals to succeed in or we'll work online i like to do online marketing kind of stuff and everything like that but uh it's sad but uh this is literally the only physical activity I get because of how bad my anxiety is like I rarely leave. I don't go out I don't go out and do anything I just stay at home watch Netflix on the computer make videos or whatever else um before this all happened, before I started having all these issues and symptoms, I used to go out every single night. And you know, like I told you guys in an old video that my, I have PVCs and my PVCs was caused by me drinking too many energy shots one night and I had to call 911. And that is what caused my anxiety and everything. So it's been getting close to about four years. That's how all that started. That's how all this started is because of me, because of the decision I made, and you know, I'm gonna live. With, I'm gonna live with that, you know. I'm gonna live with the fact that ruined my life. It's bad, but you know, I'm trying to figure out ways to deal with it and manage it. That's why I. Uh, that's why I came back to work because I did take a month off due to the virus and everything not feeling safe from it my anxiety was so high during that but working like today it's supposed to storm and i'm supposed to be out here in the country now when i get country routes my anxiety is so high and i will get pain almost everywhere it seems like because uh i don't like being stranded it's like i feel like stranded out in the middle of nowhere and uh it's possible for me to lose service and everything and like i don't know where the nearest hospital is and everything like you're always thinking when you have anxiety you're always thinking that anywhere you go you need to have a way out you need to have like just to, you know just in case because i don't know because i it's not just anxiety you know it's also health anxiety health anxiety is you know the fear of like you have all these fear of sickness you think you have you know you might get all these symptoms which your anxiety may be causing these symptoms but you may think you know you're having a heart attack you have problems with your heart or whatever else um well i get pvcs and my pvcs are not bad when i'm at home those are extra beats for your heart which i've had them tested many times i will hold a monitor i've been told you know they're fine my doctor which i'm never satisfied i'm never satisfied with the answers they give me so i've had so many tests but uh, when I'm out here working, they get so bad. I mean, so bad. It's almost to a point where I, I cannot enjoy my day. Like, I literally 
do not have good days. Like, you know, I would, I wish once in a while I could have a decent day. I would be satisfied with a decent day, but I can't even have that uh, because I'm, I'm, I'm constantly worrying. As soon as I wake up and have to go to work now, I'm constantly worrying, hoping that, you know, I don't have all these symptoms and stuff I'm trying to work. And like, I can't really, I, I'm old, my mind, my mind is always on that. And I can't just, you know, try to enjoy the day, go home and relax, watch some Netflix or whatever. It's always a pain. Because then I constantly will get dizzy too with all me moving around and everything. I do this because it is the only physical activity I get. And uh, getting that activity is good because uh, I gained a lot of weight that month. Because like, when I'm so depressed and everything, I constantly eat. Like I was constantly eating Taco Bell and Burger King every day. So, being out here, moving around is good. Um, it's raining and I won't be in the country and that makes me anxious. It's supposed to storm. Like I don't want to be out in the middle of nowhere when it storms because then I start thinking, you know, what if a tornado happens, you know, all these things come up. Now, I'm going to try to make this a series on YouTube where I just, you know, record videos of uh, me ranting about different topics. And I want you guys to chime in on them. Let me know what you guys think and uh, if you feel the same way or how you feel with your job. Because my anxiety is bad with my job. And I can't do many jobs. I figured that out. Drive, driving jobs like this, I can manage. I can't do factory work anymore. I worked at a factory for over six years. When all this has started with the anxiety and everything, I had to quit because it was so bad. So I can't be on my feet that long. I get worn out, my lower back starts really hurting bad too. There's only certain jobs I can do. So, you know, I'm, try I'm trying to keep working, you know, I'm trying to deal with it and work because I need money. And like, I just don't want to sit on my ass all day. So yeah. Get kind of close to my route. Uh, this video is about eight minutes. I'm trying, I'm trying to start making a little bit longer videos, maybe around ten minutes, ranting for you guys. Uh, but I, I really want to know what you guys think. Make sure you like this video. Also share it if you know if you know anybody that also deals with stuff like this. Um, leave me some comments. Let me know your experiences, and uh, if you want me to talk about anything else that has to do with anything mental health related or whatever um how, how i manage it uh, i never said that how i manage it i just deal with it and say you know i'm, I'm all right i'm not gonna die like because if i was gonna die i would have died already because it's been four years i deal with it you know i try to keep my mind occupied on other things while i'm working but it doesn't work all the time i get chills and all that so yeah Subscribe if you're new here guys. I am trying to grow my channel again. I'm trying to reach 300 subscribers. I need some more subs. So please subscribe. Engage with this video. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.